I want to show you what happens when you get a big girl. This is a big girl. She's a big girl. And so you can see she's two weeks old and you can see she's got this kind of walrus kind of thing where she's basically, her eyes are now open, but she's not getting up on her legs at all. And so what we're going to do is we're going to put some tape and we're going to put her legs together like this. And she's not going to like it. But And she's not gonna like it, but what it'll do is, rather than her swimming around like this, it'll make her get up on her legs, and she will get up on her legs, and it will make a huge difference. If you don't do this, you can have a problem, because if you don't do it, these legs tend to kick out, and you can actually get, she doesn't show that, but you can actually get a flat portion on their, on their um, chest as well. So, Terry, if you just hold her there for a okay. second. And uh, normally I use first aid tape, but it doesn't matter what you use. I may not do a particularly good job the first time, but what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to, here's her, here's her foot, here's her, that's her knee, that, that's her knee right there. And I'm gonna tape it between her knee and her ankle, basically. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tape her feet up like that. That's what we're gonna, that's what yeah. we're gonna try and do when we're finished. So, here we <laughs> Would go. Would you quit? <laughs> and I say, I, it's not gonna promise I'm gonna do a really good job on this the first time. And sometimes it takes me a couple of goes to get it where I like it. And I can tell you this, when you do this, other puppies and mum will take this off their legs within probably the first 12 hours. There's the first part, that looks pretty good. So now we're gonna roll this foot inside, about like that, there we go, like that. She's already not liking it. And then I'm gonna run this back through the middle just to use the tape up. No, it stuck it to itself. Here we go, somebody's sucking over there. Yes, this little little boy is to yeah. act like he's starving to death. I'll do here. Lost my tape. Well, that's fine. It went all the way around. It is fine. That's fine. That's basically, that's what we want to do. Honey, look at this. Look at this baby. Okay. I'm just going to put a little bit of tape right in the middle here to stop me sucking off. Just wrap it around the middle. And back in the top. Like there we go. That's it. That's what we're trying to do. There we go. And I'd like to I'd like to roll that in a bit more, but that's fine. That will now now just watch her for a little bit. Now she remember this is the first time this has happened to her, so she's like, what the heck's going on? But we want to see if you look at this puppy here, this puppy has its legs up underneath it. Mm -hmm. This puppy's doing fine. Now one of the times that you can have this problem is if you've got puppies that are on a slick surface, they can't get any traction, you'll see this kind of action going on. The only way to fix that is to get up on something. If it got some traction, you can see a big difference. This dog's now is moving around properly. She's getting her legs underneath her. She's just now, um, are her eyes open yet? No. no. So her eyes will open up the next few days, but she, she's still, look at this. <laughs> By the way, if you want to know if a puppy's healthy, put your finger in its mouth. And if it does this, and it feels not, nice and warm and suckling away, that is a healthy little puppy. And also, look at the little belly on this puppy. This is a small puppy, so there's a little bit of concern. Was he getting enough nourishment? Well, look at its belly. It's nice and fat. <laughs> this puppy's doing great. This is, a, this is just a small little puppy. This little boy, isn't it? Mm -hmm. yeah. This is the little boy. This is from Molly and uh, Firestarters. Mm -hmm. So there's another video that you'll see there that shows these guys off.